finding his way. He's now well, against Cameron Pilly, cut through the Australian quite quickly towards the end. Well, I think more so, we're all just happy to see a uh, fit Rami Ashur on the court. He's had a uh, terrible time of it over the last month, six weeks or so. He's, uh, he's had trouble, well-documented trouble with his hamstrings. He's been over to Qatar. He's, uh, he's seen the right people. He's worked very, very hard over the past few weeks to get himself fit enough to compete here in India. And uh, like you say, Joey, he, uh, he looks back back fit and uh, and hopefully with the match practice and he seems to be going from strength to strength he played ever so well last night against Cameron Pillay who I think is in good form anyway but this is a big test for him right now because Peter Barker has been very consistent over the past few months and uh, he's, uh, he's a, a real consistent top 10 player is Barker and someone who uh, Rami Ashura will have to be up there up there at his best really to get off tonight so Really intriguing match. This We're just one. doing a few last-minute hamstring stretches, and he had uh, his knees operated on when he was 16 years old, 15 years old, and they had to rebuild the areas around his knees with ligaments. And the hamstring, particularly on the right side, was shortened, unnaturally shortened, and that started to give him problems at the beginning of the season. Even though he's winning and beating everyone and then it just kept catching up with him he wasn't doing the right rehab and strength training he now knows what he has to do finally and hopefully this that will keep him fit and ready to challenge again for the top 